I think this is an interesting question. Have you guys got in touch with Jules? Is he going to be able to provide leadership without Brady? His fans are depending on him to prove himself uh, just as great without Brady. And I would say that's a misconception because Jules hasn't been a captain or Tom's been there. Like, he's always provided leadership. Like, you don't go out there with his kind of toughness and dedication and not provide leadership. Like, Jules has always been that guy. And I've been the captain for a lot of years, and we've always talked about some of the instrumental guys in our locker room are usually guys who are true leaders that aren't captains. Like, J-Mac falls into that category. Um, Pat Chung's been like that. Sometimes he's been a captain, other times not. But, like, his leadership doesn't change, you know, depending on the title. I would say we have guys that are great leaders. Lawrence Guy is a great leader um, that everybody on the team follows. You just don't happen to be captains. Like, there's only a certain amount of captains. Um, but I think Jules will continue to provide his leadership that he always does. Oh, for sure. I mean, when I first got there, I mean, Jules is always yelling something out, uh, motivating guys. But like you said, there's there's multiple ways to lead. And there's no better example than a guy like uh, Edel Dogs, seventh round draft pick, worked his way up to becoming a leader on a team, a Super Bowl MVP. I mean, that says it all right there. I think you don't have to say a word. If somebody just sits back and watches him, uh, you'll see. So um, before.